Hello, this is Z3PO from WMCLAN.net. Today in this tutorial I will be showing you how to change a big wave sound file that won't compile through Tool into a small sound file that will compile through Tool. What you're going to want to do is put your sound file in any folder after uh, your Halo Custom Edition root slash data. It doesn't matter where it is. Open it up in Adobe Audition 1.5, which you can download off the internet for a free, uh, free trial. Edit, adjust, uh, convert sample rate. You can also do this in other programs as well. You just have to compensate and figure out where all these things are. Make sure it's a 44.1 sample rate at 16-bit, and change it to mono. Okay, make sure these are at 50%, and just hit OK. Okay, also as you can see, this isn't completely to the top, so what you can do is Amplitude Normalize, change this to 99, just hit OK. And now it is, it will get as loud as it can without distorting. Now you can just resave this. And make sure you delete the .pk file or any other files in the folder. Make sure you only have this file. As you can see, it is now 17.4 megabytes. Okay, in this folder you can see that uh, Poncelli does not exist. So what you're going to want to do is go to Tool. Just type in Tool with quotes. You don't have to do quotes, but it works all the time with quotes. Two sounds. Just go to your folder. where the sound tag is. Make sure it's uh, OG1. Whoops. Forgot to put sounds in there. I'm just the smartest person ever, aren't I? And there we go. As you can see, it imported it into Tool, and now it's compressing it. And we have an exception fault. If you get this, change the OG value to 0.1 and try it again, and it should work. As you can see, it works successfully, and now we have a Poncelli.sound tag in this folder. You can now open this up with Tool. If you don't know where this folder it is, it is the exact same folder as the data folder, except for tags. And I did not spell that right, didn't I? There we go. Just one directory back, the name of the sound file. Okay, now you can just go back to your Halo Custom Edition root and open up Gorilla that tests out the sound tag. Make sure you change it to music unless it's not a music tag. This is a music tag. I'm just going to change the gain to 1. O compression. And I'm going to save it rerun the command I just ran in tool and when that's done I'm gonna open it back up as you can see it's now a music tag now if I play this you can see that it's working perfectly fine now let's say you want to put this in a map and for some reason it doesn't accept the dot sound tag you have to have a dot sound looping so just go into gorilla hit new tag and change this to sound looping and hit ok now scroll down here to tracks hit add change this to one if you want fade in durization i'm gonna change this to about five three three fade out uh, three okay loop what I want it to loop, I want it to loop uh, to music. Ponchelli. Yeah. And as you can see, it hasn't added it down here. 
So what you need to do is save the tag. And I'm just going to save it in the same folder. Actually, I'm going to make a new folder called Sound Loopings. Sound Looping. And I'm just going to drag that other one in there that I just created. And I'm going to name this one Boncelli. Jeez, I cannot spell today. Okay, there we go. Just hit save. As you can see, it's in here. You can click add, click on it, and play. As you can see, it works perfectly fine. You can just exit out of this. Exit out of Gorilla. Exit out of Tool. Exit out of this. Exit out of this. And put it in your map. Hope this tutorial helped you out some. Uh, again, this is E3PO from WMCLN.net. You can go to our forums at forum.wmcln.net. Goodbye.